Hello and welcome to the AmityGaming.org Ventrilo Installation Guide. You're going to be shown how to install and configure Ventrilo successfully. First off, we're going to the Ventrilo website in order to download the Ventrilo client. You can do this by either navigating to Ventrilo.com or going to Google and typing in Ventrilo. Underneath the Google results, it should be the first that pops up. On the left hand side of the Ventrilo webpage, there should be a download link. Click it. This is where your operating system comes into play. If you're on a Windows or a Mac, this is what you would choose to download. I myself am on Windows XP, so I would download the first program. This is the terms and conditions that I agree to. This will open up a download window. You can either save the file or open the program. I'm going to save the file. Once that is downloaded, you can run the program. However, I already have Ventrilo installed. Once Ventrilo is successfully installed, open up the program. First off, we're going to create a new user. Underneath the username, click on the right arrow. Then click New. Choose the name that you would like to be called as. My handle is Pure. Your phonetic name is what people will hear when you join the channel. Description and work directory are optional. After that, press OK. Now we're going to set up a server. To do this, next to the server, click the right arrow. To set up a new server, we have to click New. Name it whatever you want so that you remember. In order for the host name and port number to connect, you need to get this from either a member of the Ventrilo or the Ventrilo server owner. The port number is what defines the correct port to connect to the server. Passwords are normally optional, but some servers do require passwords. Press OK. Next, go to Setup. This is where you configure key bindings. If you would like to have a key bind, select Use Push to Talk Hotkey PTT mode. In order to select this, you click on Hotkey and then select the key that you would like. If you do not want PTT mode, unselect that and change the sensitivity and the silence time to your preference. After that, test. Press the correct button and it should successfully work. After that, press OK. Next, you want to connect to the server. And there you go. This tutorial has been completed.